hello everyone so now we can see uh, the transcription of the words in their past tense before that a person have asked me a doubt his doubt was that how should he transcribe the word Czechlo Slovakia actually the word is word sounds hard but the transcription is very easy the word is Czechlo Slovakia okay okay Czechlo Slovakia its transcription is like first ch sound okay then a sound ch k sound then the diphthong au Czechlo sa sound l sound then the a sound then vakia va ki a check cloud slovakia okay this is its transcription so now we can start transcribing the words in their past forms so before that we want to study a small topic which is very useful for transcribing words uh in the plural form and in past form that is voiceless sounds okay we have nine voiceless sounds they are p sound t sound k sound f sound t sound h Ch, sh, and so we have nine voiceless sounds. They are p, t, k, f, t, h, ch, sh, and s. Okay. So past tense are the words which comes with ed. Okay, ed form of all words. So when ed comes. We can transcribe those words in three forms. Okay, one is with t sound, t. Another is with d sound, and another is with id sound, id. Okay. So now, if t and d comes, okay, there are three forms: t, d, and id. If t sound or d sound comes. Then we are to use id for transcribing those words. Okay, let's see some example and that would be clear for you. Uh, for example, we can take a word like wanted. Want, want. T is the end sound, ending sound. So transcription is like the wo, wo, n, t, won't. And id, you should use id because the last sound is t. Wanted. Pronounce a word like wanted. And the next word is wasted. That is we a diphthong s t waste id. Okay. Then the very next word is started. Started. That is. S sound, t, start, and it started. Okay. And the next example is, if a word end with a voiceless sound, so voiceless sounds are nine. They are p, t, k, f, t, h, ch, sh, and s. If a word end in any of these sounds, then we are To use t, okay. For example, like, liked. It is like i sound the tongue here. Like and t, liked. Next word is reached. It's not reached. That is reached. This long e sound, ch. Enter. 
reached. Then comes the word booked. Ba sound, u sound, k sound, and t. Booked. Now, the last rule is we should add the sound. Okay, the sound. Whenever a voice sound comes, the sounds that are not in the voiceless sounds are the voiced sounds. Okay. All other sounds, that is, all the rest of the 35 sounds are voiced sounds. So those are like pull, pulled, p, u sounds, l, and d, d. Okay. Then is lift. Lift. Okay. So let's see some more assorted examples. Let's see now. Lighted. Okay. Transcription of light is L I Difta T. Mm? So the word ends in a sound T. So we know that if a word ends in T order, we are to use id. So lighted. Next word is kicked. Hmm? Transcription of kick is kick. Okay. And the word end with k. So it's a voice to sound. So we should use t. Okay. Kicked. Then fired. Fi difta a. Hmm? So this fire a uh, sound that is it's a voiced sound so we should use the sound for constructing its plural form uh, sorry past form founded fau diphthong found this word end with the found so we should use it found it complicate it complicated com ple k complicate plus it complicated okay killed K sound, E sound, L, kill. This end in a voice, the voice, the sound. So, should I the sound? Killed. Open. O. Pen. D. Pushed. O. Sh and T. As sh is a voice to sound, voiceless sound, we should use T. Rushed. R, T, sorry, R, sh, rush. R, A, uh, and Sh, T. Rushed. So this is all about constructing or transcribing a word's past form that is the ed form so uh, next one more topic is for transcription for constructing its plural form that is s form or es form that's also very easy in the very next video we can see that so till then see you thank you